What is up, guys? Gear get back at it again with another episode of Shiny Gold X Egglock. I literally just got back from vacation. I was out for like three days, got back, and the first thing I do instead of unwinding is get on my computer and literally record. Like, I'm still wearing the exact same thing I woke up with this morning and made the three hour drive. But that's not your business. In today's episode, it's going to be a slower episode due to that reason. I just do have to like unwind and stuff like that. So it's not going to be a lot of stuff happening, but you know, a video update nonetheless. Let's go to the burn tower. Um, we're going to go to the burn tower and we're going to do a bunch of encounters and then we're just going to get ready for the next gym. I just want to tackle on two gyms back to back like we did last time because I feel like the level gap is going to be really high and I just don't want to deal with it, you know. But with that being said, let's get started. Uh, be sure to hit the, the thumbs up button because I know you're going to enjoy today's episode. As always, I always do know that you guys are going to enjoy it. And uh, be sure to follow me on Twitter because a lot of people seem to not know that I was on vacation, but you know, I was all over Twitter on that. Um, let's see this guy. Oh, it's you! You wanted to get stronger, so you came for the legendary Pokemon that's supposed to be here. That's your story, right? Well, that's not gonna happen, because I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna be the world's greatest trainer, so a legendary Pokemon will be perfect for me. Well, anyway, I'm getting tired of having a wimp like you always showing up. You know, that makes sense. If I was the world's greatest trainer, I would also not like having wimps chase me around. Like, you, you're actually the one chasing me around, though. That's the, the thing. That's kind of not making sense to me. Let's go ahead and set up that Reflect. Oh, we went for the Detect. We outplayed the Detect by accident. That young Reflect. Alright, let's go ahead. Let's go for that Poison Powder. We're going to miss, of course. That Ice Punch did a lot of damage as well. Let's see how much it does to you. Alright, not bad, not bad. Let's go for that Stab Ember as he goes for Detect. Two Detects in a row. That's fine. That didn't do actually anything. Alright, we're going to have to heal up a bit. Nightshade does 25 clean damage every time. We got the fucking Paralyzed heal. I mean, we got Paralyzed. And not the Paralyzed heal. And there's the Burn Hacks for the win. There you go. Bayleaf. We have another Fire type. We don't need only Blaze. We have options on our team. Wicked. Get in there. Alright, level 28. And the Intimidate drop. So, that's going to be good. Alright, let's see how much a freaking minus one attack... That didn't do anything. Now, freaking Heat Wave. Might as well do half. At least half. Come on. Almost a one hit. Oh. Hit the Roo. I don't know what I was saying. Um, so, if we connect this one, that should be hit for you. And we connect it because it's Wicked. Wicked's the strongest Pokemon on our team, hands down. Question of the day. The hashtag QOTD. Who is your favorite member currently on our team? Let me know in the comments. I would have to say my favorite member is definitely Wicked, actually. I didn't even see who was switching in. Absol, okay. I think we could take that on. It's going to lower my defense, but dark types are freaking special, so... It's a 2 KO, and it's not even super effective. And then he just connects all of them, because he doesn't care. Look at that Wicked. His aiming is insane. So we got that. And then we got a Nido King. Shouldn't be too much trouble for Rainer to handle. Um, with a couple Water Guns, to be honest. Uh, three Water Guns should do it. Uh, barring a crit, we got it. Barring a crit. Can you ever say, like, barring crit in this game? And then just not jinxing it? <sighs> wow. I'm just going in for that freaking, uh... We lost Rainer for no reason. I'd rather just keep Body Slam and take down. Well, rest in peace, Rainer. Uh, I hope you guys didn't pick him for your common question of the day. <laughs> that would be pretty bad, huh? Alright. Well, let's go heal. So, continuing on, we're going to go ahead. And this is the Burn Tower, so... Is it the Burn Tower? It technically counts as a Critique City, as you guys saw. So, I'm not going to even get an encounter here. You guys let me know if it's fair for me to get an encounter or not. Um, but for now, we're just going to not use encounters. This guy's a trainer. He looks like a trainer. He definitely looks like a trainer. Yep, I came into Brownwood exactly for that reason. Actually. Oh, crap. I had a... F okay. I had a feeling that they were going to have a... Self-destruct, to be honest. So for that reason, we go into Brown Bear, just for that reason. Oh, crap. Not poison, though. We can't deal with poison. 
That's just crazy, man. Alright, thank god he didn't set the struck. We might have been screwed there. Alright, this is not doing anything, but we got there. We got through it. We got through it. I don't know. I was going to try to make like a... No, we got through it like the plot of a Pokemon game. I don't know. Something that's really easy to get through. Loki pretty salty that uh, Rainer died how he did. Always happens, man. I just realized his name is uh, Dick. Oh, I accidentally went through, but that's what we got to do. The nice little doggy says a doggy. Wow, 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 wow. Come here, the wow, wow. It's a wow, wow. I like how I'm still in the running pose or whatever. Um, so it looks like that's going to be it. I don't think any of the... Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything else we really need to do here for now. But what we can do is we can go for our new encounters of the areas. We have two or three new encounters, possibly. So we might want to use that to our advantage real quick. Let's heal up for no reason. Even though a lot of people don't like it when I do that. So we have an encounter to the left and one to the right. So we'll just take those first. Where did you say you're from? New Bark Town. Professor Elm lives over there, right? You've come a long way to get here. I have come a long way to where I currently am. Come on. Oh, there it is. So, level 16, you know, kind of behind. Please don't crit. Please do not crit. I'm just going to go for cut. Alright. I'm actually going to switch because he lowered my defense twice. And I feel like he was going to, like, crit me with, like, Hyper Fang or something. And then we would have lost him. And then I would have just been devastated. So, there you go. We got one encounter for now. We didn't even have him registered in our Pokedex, so that's good. So we got a token here. And as long as we keep getting tokens, we are fine. We got one more token right side in Dark Cave. So we're going to go away there and do that and hatch that motherfucker. Because that's who we need. To progress today's story mode. What does this guy got to say? Mount Mortar is like a maze. Be careful. Don't get lost in there. Dude, chill. We're fine. What item is this? An Ultra Ball. That's good. We also have an encounter as we surf. But for now, Mount Mortar is also an encounter. Hopefully, like, level 15 or something, too. 14. So, yeah, pretty close. And there's another Pokemon we didn't have before registered in our Pokedex, like Pokemon Go. All right. Let's see. Let's see. We captured Lemachop. Its whole body is composed of muscles. Even though it's the size of a human child, it can hurl a hundred grown-ups. Looks so cute. So we got another token. That's a token right there. It's just jibber-jabber, but it's token. Trust. Trust me. Alright, let's go back. Let's see. Let's get our two new eggs. Let's see who they're going to be. Um, everyone right now, send me a W by li liking the video. Like, if you guys like right now, 100%, no scam. Leafy reference. Uh, I will get a good encounter. But if you guys don't, then I'm going to have a bad one. So I'll know right now if you guys like this video or not right now. So let's see. Oh, this guy is definitely not here. You're over here, buddy. Alright. So we can put Blaze here for one second. Let's get my chop into the party. So remember, the first one is going to be 16 and the next one is 14. So this one has four, this one has four, and this one has four. So we get another one from here. Let's grab this one in place of the level 16 Raticate. And then we go back to the first box. So no rows, no columns. Means we can only use this row. But we can choose from between the first and the middle column. I'm going to go here because we got the last two rows filled up. So let's go and do that. Um, I hope everyone understands the math I'm doing there. So the first one is going to be level 16. And the second one's going to be 14. So let's see. Oh, let's check items, right? We should check items. So the first one has nothing. The second one has a Soothe Bell. So it's probably going to be a... I would say... A... Let's actually... um, To make things safer, just in case they both hatch at the same time. Let's actually put the second egg here first. I don't know if that makes any logic. I'm doing logic that I think is logic. But it just might not be any logic whatsoever. But to me, it sounds good. It sounds like a good plan. Why is this taking forever to hatch? It's almost ready to hatch. It says, it, it says it's almost ready. Like, it's just waking up right now in the morning. Like, ugh. 
like when you're groggy and you don't know when to get ready and stuff. That's the egg right now. Let's see who we get. Another Growlithe. That's understandable. So let's see what nickname he's got. So if your name is Ezzy, we got your Growlithe. You better be showing us some liking. Letting us know that we captured it. I'm guessing the person's name is Ezzy who submitted this. And we got to get him to level 16. So we got to do that before we forget. Level 16, Ezzy. So now if freaking Wicked just does go down, we do have a replacement for him. Very sad stuff though. If he does go down. I think Wicked is probably my favorite Pokemon on our team like I've said before. He's got the same egg moves and everything. Except he has Crunch. Which sort of makes him a little better. So let's see who we get out of the Machop encounter. Which is level 14. Because I, I want some... Uh, some stuff. We lost a water type, so maybe a water type would be really good, actually. So let's see what we get. Come on. Come on. Come on. I believe. I believe. So this guy just woke up, too. Apparently, he doesn't want to come out of the freaking egg. Come on. Look, look, look how fast we're going. There you go. Let's see what it is. Hopefully, it's a water type or, like, something else. Maybe something that could deal with ghosts. I'm not even mad. We, ha we need a flying type, I think. Um, so let's see what nickname this one has. So, upon closer examination, in all lowercase letters, we have Urza. Welcome to the team, Urza, because Urza is joining our team, guys. Um, yeah, not much said there. We're, he's just joining our team. So let's go in. Let's withdraw Blaze. And yeah, so Urza's part of the team now. Oh, we got to recount him up to 14. Um, so yeah, that might be good. He might actually have just good it moves. I'm not sure why they gave him supersonic. That doesn't sound right, so we're just going to take it off. And 12, 13. Wing attack is really strong. We'll take our growl, though. We can uh, keep pursuit because pursuit might be pretty decent sometime down the f down the future um, but for now let's go in here and do this mini quest to get surf might be very important so let's go ahead and check take on the freaking five evolutions of this game um, I don't know which order they are in this is Flareon so pretty much we would have had good territory if freaking you know Rainer was still around but he's not that was a nice crit almost destroyed me Almost destroyed me already. Poor Blaze. In the mix, already not being able to be in the in said mix. Is Bailey part poison type? It's not. I think he has synchronized though. He has synchronized. Alright, so I was right on my hunch. We have antidotes though. I don't know if you have antidotes. Is the problem, sir. So now we just go into Knights Out. You sound attack me, I don't care. I bite you, you die. I, I bite you, you die. There you go, I was correct, you know, that poison coming clutch, my dog barking, everything happening at the same time, it's straight. So now we got Umbreon here, I think we're Poison Powder as well, even though I know he has Synchronize, okay, you're not, you're not, you're not doing this to me. Look like I got mad. I got pursued. Wow. That's dumb. My dog doesn't stop barking. That's worse, to be honest. <sighs> and we got the flinch hacks, though. That's a bright side, right? <laughs> yeah, right? We lost a team member. Yeah, awesome. I love this game, guys. Love it. Very fun experience for all. Why is this guy so strong? Like we're like we're not gonna last in the fucking. You can't tell me we're gonna last at the fucking um, gym at this rate. Parish count fell to two. You flinch. As long as you don't destroy poor Wicked, I think Wicked could take it. There you go. You're dead. All right. Got to use strats to be honest. All right. Last one. We'll just stick with you, sir. Brown bear. 
you brown excuse of a bear. There you go. Thank you, brown bear. Can't learn scary face. No, I don't want you to. I'm against scary faces, to be honest. And then we get surf from this guy. I am actually really mad, personally, at Bayleaf's death. Could have been avoided, I guess, kind of. Should have healed, I guess. Should have predicted the freaking pursuit. I don't know, I guess. Something you can't really predict, though. Um, I'm going to get that Miracle Seed back, even though we're probably never going to need it. I just don't want Bayleaf to have it. I don't want Bayleaf to have it. If only like we had a stronger like starter Pokemon, but I'm not going to ex have excuses there. Um, there wasn't really much we could do, to be honest. And with that, we got our seventh member gone for the count. And I'm not going to even put any of these guys in our party, to be honest. Wasn't Vale supposed to be a Vaporeon, though, I think? But it's just level 6 right now. I don't really want to get into that kind of business. We might be able to get into another route early before the next gym leaders in tomorrow's episode. So that might not even be too much of a problem, I think. But with that being said, I'm just going to end it off here. We lost two team members today, so it was a pretty bad day in playing. I guess it could contribute to the fact that I get, got back from vacation, but I'm not going to have excuses because I'm not one for excuses. Um, but with that being said, I'm actually going to go on this route, fight all the trainers and just stuff in general. Just like level up everybody. Um, I feel like I'm pretty weak. Hopefully if I can get everyone to like 27-ish, I'll be happy, but I might not even reach there. But with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a like rating. If you didn't, let me know why you didn't like it. Stuff like that. Always improving, and uh, yeah, catch you guys next episode. Peace.